today I am super excited. I get to finally unbox this box. The first thing we're going to unbox today is the Loam Tap C Stand. <clears throat> first, I got to get this box out of the way. This actually came highly recommended. It comes with three little clips, comes with instructions, and this really cool sealable little sandbag for putting water in to, for stability. Instructions, uh, got another clip, one grip arm, got the base. Because you know I'm all about that base, about that base, no trouble. Here. First of all, shout out to Saki Anderson for providing me with some slice gear to make sure I don't hurt myself when I'm opening up my boxes. Cuts right through it like butter. I heard there was some something that somebody mentioned about how you do this. There. One. Two. Just like that. Pretty simple. Pretty wide base. It's huge. And then comes cool. So I've got the grip arm. Ooh, I got the oh, I always like when I get cards. Little envelope with do-it-yourself custom backdrop from Loam Tap, the website to go get some backdrops. And we have something and so good that they give me two, two warranty cards in such fine print that it says. Thank you for your purchase. You could get a free warranty for one year. During the warranty, we provide a free replacement for problem caused by quality and transportation. Please activate this warranty card within 30 days of receiving the goods. But then I wanted to show you, I've got the grip arm, and now another, another grip head. Loam tap, loam tap, loam tap? And obviously this will be uh, I will do a full review video of this later when I actually get it all set up. I'm going to take out the main arm. There's a lot of reviews I saw in this C stand that claimed it wasn't very heavy duty. Man, this feels stout. Or release this clamp so you can actually slide the C stand, the main bar, inside it. And just like that, locks in place. And then this, uh, so it's spring mounted. This thing goes obviously all the way to the ceiling. I don't need that. But from what I understood, is you slide this over this, clamp it down, and then you loosen this one. No, that's backwards. I just set that up wrong. This is why we do these things. Houston, we have a problem. So you failed. All right. You really failed. So I should probably read the destructions. So yeah, I did that wrong. So the loam tap, so it goes on here. So release this. This slide, there we go. See that? And then this is what the bar slides through. So, just like that, and then I lock it down. Wow, this is pretty quick. And then I slide this one over top. Let's see how that's going to work. Oh, it actually has. So for this one, it's funny on their, <laughs> on their instructions. So I don't know if you can see this, but uh, they have... If I can focus in on that, but here towards the bottom they have two sets of one, two, three. So instead of going one, two, three, four, five, six, you have the little things. You are actually sliding this through. So how does so if this clamps on here, so how do I that's why this is gonna take a little while. But I can't really do anything else until get this thing out of the way. It's pretty heavy duty. 
So I would attach, oh I know, I would attach one of my spigots. I don't want to push that through my light box. So I would have a spigot coming off of here and then I would have it mounted to a ball head and then I would come down with the camera. I think this is going to be pretty sweet. Really solid grip right here for moving the stand around. It does. It feels very sturdy. I'm pretty excited. So what else do I got to talk about the low tap? So a couple features about the Loam Tap C-Stand. It stands a full 10 feet 8 inches, which in my small studio, I will never need that. So the minimum height at its lowest height is 5 feet, which actually might work out fairly well for me in this studio. The boom arm length is just a little over 4 feet. Uh, there are quarter inch and 3 eighths uh, threaded studs on each end of the grip arm. It comes with the two grip heads, so you can mount one to the actual C-stand itself, and then the other one you would actually mount to the end of the grip arm and then add your attachments to it. The base can be expanded up to 120 degrees to provide for better stability. It comes with the carrying bag, three clips, so if you wanted to put a backdrop or something a reflector off of the stand, you have those. It also comes with the fillable just a stability bag or a weight bag to provide for stability so it doesn't tip over on you. So that is the Loam Tap C-Stand.